Alright, recap in NMHC, what are the lessons learned this week? Yeah, I mean, uh, we're out here in Las Vegas, finishing up a couple days in the conference room. Nice to get out, see the people of Las Vegas a little bit. Yeah, lessons learned, I mean, I think what your game plan is for 2023, number one. Look at your current portfolio, figure out if you have any maturities coming up, interest rate caps. Let's figure out what, what to do with the portfolio, number one. Alright, you go. Number two, try to figure out a way to uh, prolong and stay in the game as long as you can. We gotta win the battle, as Paul would say, so we can also win the war. So that means, you know, having cash on hand, having more equity, raising equity, capital calls, a lot of what we've been hearing. And just so you can kind of shore up the balance sheet and, and uh, make sure that you make it up to the other side of these rate cuts. All right, lesson three. Lesson three, be ready to buy. So a lot of guys out there um, have capital ready to go. So people are thinking this is going to 6%, 7%, 8% cap rates. Nope, people are stepping in right now and buying deals at 525, five and a half. They're putting on debt at 525, five and a half. So it's not negative leverage, probably neutral. Uh, you're not getting a ton of positive leverage, except maybe if you go to secondary tertiary markets. And then lesson four for New syndicators or people that haven't been in the game for quite as long. I think people are going to start looking for smaller deals. You know, 50 to 100 units what we heard. People are looking for smaller equity checks, uh, smaller raise, just because it is so difficult to raise in this environment that people still want to do deals, but, you know, they're just going to buy the right deal. Instead of coming to NMHC saying, you know, we're buying 200 doors, B-class, uh, we're going to be a little bit more realistic this year, I think, and, and get a, a good size deal, you know, 50 to, to 100 units. And then we're going to wrap up lesson five with the airplane analogy. So we are the air traffic controller. Your plane's in the air, you got to make sure it lands. So figure it out, call us, figure out what uh, options you have, whether it's uh, fixed, Fanny, Freddy, uh, bridge to bridge, preferred equity. We sort of know all those sources and can underwrite the deal, figure it out, and then make sure you articulate that plan because I think when you're going back to your investors, making sure they understand what you're doing, how you're doing it, that's how you're gonna raise additional capital if you need it in today's market or go raise some new capital for a new deal. All right, back to you. <laughs>